Hey everybody. So here we are. I guess this is day three, even though I didn't start again until noon today because I had some stuff to do this morning and I uh, had to get her done. So I started about noon and it's about, I don't know, 3.30 right now. So I've got all this done. And this might have been a little overkill, but um, it's going to be a good solid floor. I mean, I, these are spaced about every 30 centimeters like every foot and I could have gone like 45 which is like 18 inches but I had when I originally bought all the boards I wasn't sure which way I was going to run the boards because I didn't know what was underneath the tatami and um, if I had run them the other way I would have wanted to go on the 30 centimeter yada yada anyways I decided just I mean I got two extra boards right up there oh and this works doesn't hit the thing so that goes up to there so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to, this wall is getting a little crappy anyways. And there's actually a spot here where I think the tenant leaves his window open all the time. <clears throat> and there's water damage there. But to fix that, unfortunately, there's a gas outlet there. And I have to call the Tokyo gas guys in. And uh, I'm going to just seal that up. And uh, then I think I might, uh, I might put a coat of paint on this room. Or at the very least on, on well, probably the whole bloody room. You know, because... What I'd like to do is paint these posts so they kind of disappear. If I paint them white, the, if I try to match the brown, it's never going to happen. So, anyways, uh, next up, I got to bring in the styrofoam and start cutting it up. I think I'm just going to use a, a sharp knife and just a, a straight edge and cut her up. Should work good enough. Um, the insulation, you know, didn't cost very much. It was maybe maybe 30 bucks, maybe a little more than that, maybe 40 bucks for all the insulation for this floor. So. Um, I figure it's cheap cheap insurance to you know just keep things warmer because I mean these hardwood floors or these engineered floors are certainly going to be a lot uh, they're not going to be nearly as warm as the tatami because the one thing about tatami is they actually act as an insulating barrier 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 you know because uh, they're like an inch and a half thick of straw right so it's like good insulation so so I thought I put the insulation in and the one layer of plywood and then the flooring on top of that it should be good to go anyways back at her well it's about 6 30 so it's time for me to head out i got about five and a half i guess six hours in today not a full day but not bad so the all the sticks are down and the, the insulation is all in and so tomorrow i'll put the plywood down oh you hear that noise Twinkle, twinkle, little star. So if you think that's the ice cream truck, you're wrong. That is the truck selling kerosene. Yeah, I know. When I first lived here, I, in the middle of winter, I hear the song and I thought it was a uh, ice cream truck. And I thought, what the? It ran out and it's a kerosene truck. Kind of funny. Anyways, this is going really well. I'm pleased with this. Um, tomorrow, I'll get that bar up here. I didn't bring my pipe cutter thing to cut that. Um, it's like a plastic covered metal pipe I guess you can't see that but uh, it's uh, like metal on the inside with a plastic on the outside and you put it together with the plastic kind of joints and then you put this glue in that melts the two together and then I usually put a uh, drill a screw into them just to be safe anyways I wanted to say everybody thanks for watching and following along I got some new specs um, they actually come stock with these uh, little uh, eye protection things on here. These are, are basically, I'm, I, I don't need glasses for looking far away. I only need glasses for looking close up. So these ones are designed for like in the room and close up. They're not really for driving, looking when you look far away, they don't really work. So I got another pair for those. But yeah, these are kind of cool. I like having the extra side protection. You know, I mean, it's not perfect. It's not, you know, like tight on my face, but it's a lot better than nothing having something there. Those do come out too if I wanted to I could take them off, but I'm going to use these as work glasses. My other glasses that I had before are just so scratched up I could hardly see out of them. So I finally splurged and bought some new glasses. Anyways, everybody, um, I really appreciate you watching and following along. Please uh, like and uh, subscribe if you haven't and leave a comment. See ya.